So the best environment to start training in is at home, somewhere that's safe, somewhere the puppy knows and they're not going to get distracted by. So your living room or the garden, whatever you've got, but whatever's enclosed, an environment they know so they're not going to get distracted by it is really the best place where they're going to be able to give you their full attention. Individual training sessions should only last really five to ten minutes depending on where your dog's up to with its level of training. A more advanced dog could probably do 15, 20 minutes depending on what you're after achieving, but much more than that and they do get bored. All puppies and all dogs will learn at their own rate. Some breeds like Collies that are really finely tuned to work with humans and are really motivated and active can learn things in just a, one or two little sessions. Other breeds that are maybe a little bit more laid back about life, it might take them a little bit longer but they'll all get there eventually at their own rate. Ideally, if you can spend enough time and effort with your dog training, you should be able to teach an exercise for, like the sit, for example. Mouse sit. Good girl, mouse. Within two weeks in all environments, from starting off a nice sterile environment in the house, possibly, to a busy high street where there's people, cars, buses going past, and all kinds of distractions, you should be able to expect your puppy to sit there as well. It's quite possible to train a number of different commands in the same session. So you might start with a little bit of sit and then try some down. Neb, down. And then a bit of recall. Neb, come, good boy. And this can help to break the session up, keep your puppy's attention and motivation for longer. If that's too much for them, just work on one at a time. And it's so important, know your puppy, know what they can cope with, know what they like doing, and really stick within what they want to do.